Now, your KSBW weather forecast with Chief Meteorologist Lee Solomon. Good evening, everybody. Quick check on the temps, and it was another either hot day or very hot day. All triple digits, 103 to 108 Santa Cruz Mountains, uh, low 90s in Santa Cruz. Cool spot Aptos at 76, but it was 100 in Coralitas, 106 in Gilroy, uh, 102 in Hollister. And for some spots like Gilroy in King City, I think this is just about day seven of 100 plus. And some of those days were 110, 112, 116. 97 in King City earlier today. Again, a little bit of a cool down for them. Uh, but they'll rebound probably tomorrow. But again, triple digits, Soledad, Gonzalez, low 90s here in Salinas. And we actually got to 91 in Monterey. So kind of the hottest day so far in this uh, string of heat for the Peninsula 102 Carmel Valley. It's still hot, although not at the coast. We got a little sea breeze, upper 60s, Santa Cruz, Monterey, back to 70s, 80s, Salinas. But again, upper and middle 90s in San Jose right now, still 96. So tough to cool down the house if you don't have AC when it's 96 at this hour. Future cast show in the dome, and it is a huge dome of heat across the west. Another hot day tomorrow. Central Valley will be around 110 plus, and we'll see numbers close to that in some areas here. That should be the last of it. By Friday, we'll see a little bit of cooling, start to knock the edge off of it. High pressure starts to wane and move out. And by Saturday and Sunday, a lot more cooling. You can see the high heat is long gone. So there is a major cooling trend for the weekend. Uh, but we're also watching uh, something else called a Hurricane K. And we're going to get to that. 110 Sacramento right now, 109 Fresno, 108 Bakersfield, lots of 70s along the coast. So again, the coast has been the place to be 80s up there in Lake Tahoe. Tomorrow again, 111, 108, 106. Uh, easily these spots could be 110 tomorrow, Fresno, Bakersfield. So I don't know if you can tell the difference between 107 and 110, but either way, just a scorcher. Again, the overdrive on the AC and the power grid going to be stressed tomorrow. Visible and then into the infrared we go. There's the eye. This is Hurricane K, a Cat 2. Big hurricane, by the way. Uh, very large. Tropical storm force winds extend over 200 miles from the center. So they're getting some of that along the Baja Peninsula. Really nice looking hurricane uh, off of Baja right now. Nice meaning uh, in meteorological sense. Not nice if you live along the peninsula. Although, again, most of the heavy stuff is well off the coast. So they are getting rain, they are getting some wind, but they're not getting hurricane force winds. But we will track this as it moves north. Now, as it goes north, it's going to get into much colder waters, which is not good for hurricanes. Still probably be a hurricane tomorrow and then wind down into a tropical storm probably by Friday. This is probably a little bit behind in terms of the forecast. It'll probably be weaker than this, but look how close it gets to maybe Ensenada or San Diego. It's not going to hit California because it's going to end up tracking off the coast a little bit and weaken, but they'll get some wind and they'll potentially get some rain in Southern California from this on Saturday and Sunday. The question is, does it take this really steep turn or does it come further north and maybe give us not only clouds, but maybe some rain here? And we'll be watching that closely. Uh, when you track hurricanes, it's really a day by day deal when you're talking about small shifts in the track. So uh, we've got a couple of days to watch that 57 to 70 uh, warm inland tonight. Obviously uh, tomorrow, 70s, 80s and 90s coast with some heat advisories for Santa Cruz County, 94 to 108 inland excessive heat warning still up 70 San Francisco, 100 San Jose. One more day to kind of just take it easy if you can. 108 Boulder Creek, 104 Scotts Valley, 80s and low 90s though around the beaches and 100 in Coralitas, 103 Morgan Hill, 106 Gilroy, 102 Hollister with 80s in Moss Landing, 90s in Prunedale, low 90s Salinas, triple digits all the way down the Salinas Valley, 102 in King City, and a mix of 70s and middle and upper 80s around the peninsula, Carmel Valley, 102. UKSBW eight day forecast. So significant cooling even at the coast through the weekend back to 60s and 70s. The clouds, by the way, could be some marine layer, but I'm putting them in because of the remnants of what would have been Hurricane K, which will be disintegrating. Triple digits turn into 90s mostly on Friday and then 70s and 80s for the inland valleys. Again, watching the tropics, maybe for some rain showers. We don't want the thunderstorms, so it's a double edged sword. I'd love to have a soaking rain, but I'd rather not have the thunderstorm sure. because right. sure. that could be tough. Most likely we won't see anything, but we're watching it because, you know. You never know. You never know. But, but San Diego and Southern California, likely they, that they're going to yeah. see something. And I can say this. I've been forecasting here 22 years. I don't remember tracking a hurricane up the coast. Yeah. <laughs> so right? it's been a while, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's been quite a while. Yeah. And, you know, on top of all-time record heat, 116 in King City yesterday. So sure. Yeah. Crazy. Yeah. Let's take a look at our weather quiz. 
and it has to do with hurricanes. About once every 20 years, a tropical storm hits San Diego. It doesn't happen often. I don't really remember. I don't remember one, but and this one's not going to hit. It's just going to get the rent. You know, it's, 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 it's usually about, you know, the impact there is usually about, even with tropical storms, about 100 miles, 150 miles north of Cabo, right? Dan, you're on it. You're on top yeah. of it. Yeah, it's just the remnants. You know, yeah. we, ne we don't get hit with the tropical storm because you have to have the wind. They do get some rain, sometimes right. they get showers, it's off the coast, it's the remnants, but a tropical storm hitting? Nah. Yeah. yeah. Nor, I think, was the last one. I think that was in 97, if I remember correctly. All right. Just doesn't happen often. All nope. right. Thanks, Lee. You're welcome.